our third installment of Business Apache, we're going to set up the limits for groups. Now, as we ended the second installment, we rebooted. We installed Quota. We touched the files. We set the permissions on those files. And we set up Etsy FSTAB. And so everything in theory should work. So if you type Quota, it doesn't do anything, seemingly, but it doesn't give you an error either. Now, uh, something I need to go back and remind you of at all times is I, I'm a guy that immediately goes into sudo bash. So many of the commands you need to do, like app get install, if you're not root user, it's sudo app get install. So just remember that. Um, so quota didn't give you an error, but it didn't show you anything. And that's because we haven't set up any quotas. So the next thing we need to do is set up some quotas. So the way you do that is ed quota dash g. Now dash g is for group because that's what we want to set up in this case is groups, not users. You could do users, but you in this case we want to set it up for a group. So one of the groups is Bob. So we set up Bob. All right now. There's the disk that he's allowed to use. There's the number of blocks in it. There's the soft. There's the hard. And this is in megabytes, so let's do 50 megabytes. So this is for group Bob. We're going to have a 50 megabyte limit. Save it. Done. Now let's go do Bill and go back down here, file system, blocks, soft, hard, 50 megabytes again, save it, and Curtis is the third one. And file system, blocks, soft, hard, 50. All right, so in theory, we've set up the quotas for those three groups. And if you type quota, hold on for a minute. Okay, sorry for the delay. I had to go look up the man page to get the exact syntax. Um, what you actually type in is quota dash G for group and then the name of the group. And as you see, I did Bob. And if you do quota dash Bill, and again, you've got that 50 megabyte limit. And we should check it. And yes. And there's Curtis as well. So the three groups now have a 50 megabyte limit each for their file system usage.